Okay, so there are just a few things you need to know when reflecting algorithms. The first one is you need to change the direction of each quarter turn. So for example, if you if an algorithm says U and the reflected algorithm, you have to change that to U prime. And another example is if an algorithm says F, the reflected algorithm has to have an F prime. Another thing you need to know is that you have to change all R's to L's and all L's to R's. Okay, so on the T permutation algorithm, these two are switched and then these two are switched. And the algorithm is R U, R prime, U prime, R prime, F, R2, U prime, R prime, U prime, R U, R prime, F prime. But if you wanted to mirror that, which would switch these two and these two instead of these two and these two, we would go, I see an R, so we have L prime. Then where there's U, U prime, R prime, L, U prime, U, R prime, L, F, F prime, R2, U prime, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, F prime, or, yeah, we'll switch is these two and these two. So for the ZBF tool cases, I taught you eight of them when it's oriented, the pair is facing to the right. I suppose you get a pair facing toward the left. You'd hold it like this and do the same algorithm but you do the mirrored version. So the algorithm for this one is U prime, so I do a U, F prime, so I do an F, there's a U, so I do a U prime, then there's an F, so I do an F prime. So that's pretty much how it works. Just remember that instead of holding it like this, you hold it like this. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. See you next time. It's recording there.